Good morning, everybody. It's another beautiful morning here in Alaska. I've got a little project going on today that I'd like to take you guys along for. I am milling my own lumber, and I'm going to take you through this process to kind of show you how it's done. And uh, the reason I'm milling my own lumber is because where I'm at, there is no Home Depot. So if there's something you want to build, well, you need lumber, and there's nowhere to go get it, so you've got to mill your own. So I'm going to walk you through this process, and uh, hopefully you enjoy it. We'll see. So the first thing you have to do is you have to build a guide rail system. And what this guide rail system does is it allows you a, a flat level plane, and that sits on top of a log. And basically, it's like a ladder. You place that on top of the log, and you screw it down, and that firmly places your guide rail system on top of your log. And what that basically does is it allows the chainsaw mill guide to run on top of it so you can get a smooth first cut. And I'll show you that. Which basically, that's what you end up with. Once you've got that first cut made, which is called your cant, you take that off and you no longer need that guide rail over there because the guide rail on the saw will run straight on the, uh, the board or your log. So I'm going to show you how this is done. Uh, please bear in mind that this is not a fast process by any means, but the end result is a straight piece of lumber. Uh, right now I'm cutting two inch slabs that I will rip down into usable lumber. I'm trying to build a kitchen work surface for the cabin. So I'm going to take you along through this process and uh, show you uh, how, how it happens. So here we go.